members of SF CNM TV once again. Thank you so much for following our channel. Today, we are going to present to you this special uh, ceremony. The ceremony of Holy Because we know that we may have participated in different uh, ceremonies, but or you may have participated in a wedding ceremonies in Rwanda, but not the wedding Manasa. Why am I emphasizing this? Because I know that I have seen sure wherever you are in the world watching this video you will see a very big difference between wedding ceremony you participated in and the wedding herself to be married as a whole. While many women, many girls, they get married, one part, some of them, they get married just for uh, marrying the body, the husband, but not marrying the mind and the spirit. This day of March 23, Pastor Emmanuel has confirmed the love, the true love of Jane. Look at that uh, situation. Jane, uh, the sister of uh, uh, another girl, she's a big sister, but the sister could not understand how her big sister is leaving her go to live forever with her husband. She has to accept it because uh, Jane has been promoted from a girl to a woman who has, has a legal known husband who is called Manasseh before the government institutions and before God and his uh children in the church so this is 
a, a special time for everyone to think about. Yeah. So, uh, Josian could not uh, could not understand how her sister is going away and the time the good time they had together in singing at home uh, where we're starting the Sabbath doing uh, homeworks uh, many activities together but now she has to accept that Jane is forced to leave the home of our, our brother Jonathan and uh, his wife to go uh, for being wife and So uh, it's not easy. Sang a very touching song. My husband, you are my head, and I will respect you all my life. It is a very big, very strong than what we do in the sector of this. Am I saying this because all of those commitments and those marks? The time comes, we say no, we are no longer in that uh, commitment. We have changed the direction. They decide to separate, but the commitment of change is this song. Always. Remind uh, her that one day she stood before many people in the eyes of Yahav, meeting uh, herself that she accepts without force, without any advice, but with full meeting. Alright, forever. With her friend. In her song, she has said a, a very big request. She said that in the past, for these years, there has been a lot of things which could. Uh, And we love putting coronavirus. We kill one of them. And uh, we love and from them. That's what I have. Uh, I picked our own song. Not only that, even the effects of COVID and after it, all of them. But because of our mighty God, our lovely Father, Heavenly Father, that one did not make any negative impact. Thank you, uh, oh Lord, God, through Yeshua Mashiach Man, because we fulfill uh, the promises. Narrating these uh, songs and uh, events to let everyone, wherever you are in the world, to get this message because marriage is a project started by the Creator Himself, the Creator Himself in Eden. Pastor is doing it. Uh, in the church, you see the message he is delivering to uh, 
the bride and the groom. Yeah, pastor is doing his business. But pastor should do that to confirm what uh, those two people have already uh, accepted themselves to do it and to be it. So, Jane has accepted to quit being a girl to be a woman, a wife to a husband, to be uh, quit to be independent girl to be a dependent woman to the husband. Quitted to be uh, free in uh, every situation and committed to be uh, subject to the rules and the laws of the husband. Manasseh has committed himself to quit being a, a free man, a young man, to be uh, under the law. Get married. Not just getting married for uh, doing it because other people have done it or your parents have done it. Do it because you understand very well the journey started and uh, put in mind that that journey is safe. When you walk along, Yeshua, Hamashiach. Because without Yeshua, Hamashiach, nothing is possible. Nothing is possible without Jesus. Good enough, this couple have accepted without any uh, sight uh, advice from anybody to accept it. Whatever you have seen happening in the church, whatever you have seen happening in the family, whatever you have seen happening in the office, the government, all those uh, procedures were there to confirm the old commitment. To respect the when she took time to sing song half hard when I'm hearing, she was having intuition or revelation. That she has seen one she longs with the one she wishes to be the part of her body. You know, according to the Bible, uh, a young, 
a single man is halfway to a human. And a single girl is halfway a woman. This choir was singing to confirm that these people have decided to unite today to be one body, one spirit, and one soul. There's another thing people do not understand. When a woman, a girl, and a, a young man decided to marry, they, will, they, they decide to be one body. Meaning, even the uh, Morito uh, meeting in the private room means a lot of things. Let me tell you the secret here. If you did not uh, marry the brain of a girl or a man, the body married is useless. That's why the true marriage starts from the brain and comes to the body. Sex is useless if it is practiced without marriage of the brain. A bit again. Sex of married couple is useless when that couple is not married uh, in their brain. Meaning, before you make the contact of your body, your mind. Your spirit should marry fast. Should marry fast. Let me give you an example of the, the, the woman who got married uh, spiritually but uh, bodily or fresh is not married. Mary accepted to be married uh, with the Holy Spirit even without fresh marriage and that spiritual marriage yielded the body of Yeshua Mashiach the man and the, the angel uh, told Mary when uh, she received a message that she will give birth the savior of the world he said no why how that one will happen since i do i did not meet any a man and i don't have a husband a human husband the, whole, the, the angel told her that the whole spirit will come over you and they cover you you will get married you will get pregnant so the same way our uh, offspring, our op offspring, our children should first enter in the mother from the spirit before the husband introduce any fresh uh, item, their wife to uh, form a baby. Women who oh, have husband should pray so that before a husband introduce anything in their body for forming children, whole spirit first should do that job the body of the woman and they prepare the egg so that when uh, the cell from the sperm of a husband enters into the womb of a woman should meet the, 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 the password of the Holy Spirit in the body of that woman so that it confirms that 
the cell, the half cell coming from the husband is going to meet the half cell of the egg of the woman to make a, a creature, a spiritual creature which will, will wear the body. So, Mimi, whatever you are seeing here, look at what uh, the auntie of James have said here. First of all, she said, praise the Lord our God. Because we could think about this today, marriage of Manasseh and Jane. But today, God making, God made, we are seeing it with our naked eyes. So that's why I'm standing here as a witness to sing the praise of our God. That's why you see our sister Miret uh, is singing as the auntie of Jane who praised God for the work and the wonderful job God has done for liberation and the enforcement, the marriage of Manasseh and Jane. This woman was filled with joy, happiness, because of uh, God, our God has made us happy and enjoying the ceremony, the marriage ceremony, the wedding. Her friend, her close friend, missed the place. We did not miss the place. You know who is that? Is a friend who used to sing in the work of the same choir. That one wearing black uh, clothes and the red uh, shoes. Uh, They are to enjoy the marriage of her close friend, as they used to say that they were twins. Oh, they are twins because of how they feel together in the work of God, singing, uh, expressing the praise of our God. Yes. So, uh, this is very uh, depressing issue. I think not everywhere we see such They were enjoying. Look at her. Look at those girls. How they were enjoying. Yeah, look at them. Look, look, very good. Jen, yeah, her friend. So, they're enjoying the marriage of Jen, Jati, and the Jen. They really uh, enjoyed this day. Look, in the song uh, narrated by the auntie. Great. Jen and Janti really enjoyed uh, the day. So Jen not only uh, made her marriage very attractive, also she made it very blessed. She look when she came uh, up from outside from taking the pictures, memory of the wedding day, entering with her husband to the audience, they have to entertain us. Jane herself was narrator of the ceremony, singing loud, greatest, uplifting, 
being very happy for this nation of quite beautiful. So at this faith March 2023 is a very special day for the people who participated in the wedding and asked And I think who were not there that's why S CNM TV was there. Wherever you are, you are in, the, in the corners of the world, enjoy with us this ceremony, which was very sweet and honey. You know, how happy is sweet. This uh, ceremony was a sweeter and happy. Sure. Because of how we enjoy it. And uh, we were blessed. We were blessed. Because even this time, normally in the, the country where we are, uh, Soon it will be a time of rain, of the rain. But specifically today, no single time. Well, some people have a myth about the rain uh, and uh, the ceremony. I don't mind about it. Whatever myth you can have. That. So, what my best. What I have enjoyed and I have enjoyed that we have then we had a very good time and the So, not only that, there has been many people enjoying. Ceremony, uh, I give credit to the family of uh, Amos Mugisha, even though he was not there. It's uh, deception because of other duties, but those who represented him, they uh, gave us a message. That from the young age of Jane, parents and Jane uh, and other parents go in a special place, purposely for the children, and they put them in the hands of the Creator so that they may go up. Uh, with the Holy Spirit and uh, with the, uh, the blessings of all kinds including uh, respecting parents, being obedient and uh, being wise, intelligent and uh, being able to acquire Thank you so much for the message you delivered. All people who gave messages, including the, the, the parents' message, were touching. 
the heart of the people. At the church, many people were there, ready to surround Manasseh and Jane and their parents in this special day, which we never come back near. That picture in front of the church, meaning that you are rough, you had the heart you expressed in the front of many witnesses, including the angels of heaven and the Father Yahweh, through Yeshua Mashiach. That picture confirms that that you did not keep your love in secret, but expressed so that everyone may know that you had your love in your heart or in your mind, but you express it publicly in front of many witnesses. So that's the meaning of that picture from the church. So that swearing, that swearing ceremony inside the church, that is a holy place. Look at the color of that place. That means that you sworn in before uh, God Himself. Yeah. That what you have uh, accepted, you will continue to be that, not changing anymore. So that's very good. And uh, to be appreciated. Yeah, it is very good. It should be really appreciated by everyone because uh, your commitment is off and they're worthy of expressing my people like you because. Uh, what you have accepted from your young age. What do I mean by that? Just accepting to be the children of God. And when you accept to be the children of God, you accept to abide yourself to the wrongs of God, including respecting marriage. Yes. Hug your wife and Jen hug husband because uh, today uh, you have been uh, uh, allowed to be one body. You accepted it, the secret, but today in the public uh, it is pronounced that Jen is no longer single. Manasseh is no longer single, but both accepted to be one body, one spirit, and one soul. Again, I am, let me repeat it. In front of many witnesses, Manasseh and Jen accepted from the deep mind and commitment that today they accepted themselves without any force upon them to be one body, one spirit, and one soul. Okay? That is what it means to stand in front of people in the church there the place where it is called the holy place to pronounce that pastor did not put you uh, in the public to pronounce those words but no in the front of the group to mean that pastor is staying there but is staying as a servant to the Creator or in the place of the Creator to pronounce the uniting 
ceremony of two people. Yeah. One was called a single man, another one was called a single girl, but together they become one person, a husband, a wife. Manasseh. Young people around the world learn from this couple. Make a commitment of what you will be if you decide to live that life you live in. Life of single bachelor. American call single bachelors. Not a bachelor's degree. But bachelor as a single, that is American English. Single people are called bachelor. So when you live to be a bachelor, you become a master of the family. A husband live the life of a bachelor and become a master of the family. And a woman, a girl, live the life of a bachelor and become a mistress of the family. Because a wife will have the responsibility to look after children, teaching them. But first of all, carrying children for nine months in her womb teaching them, singing for them, feeding them. And the husband has the responsibility to care on those children while they are still in the womb, singing to them, caring to them, and feeding them. Whatever the husband do to the wife will make an impact on the children in the womb. So, education of children doesn't stand when a woman, a, ch a child is born or a woman has given birth. No. Education starts even the first day when you do uh, a secret uh, marital uh, meeting in your private room. First pray for it. No, never as you can never eat food before you pray. You should even pray for that action. To be successful, but to give a good future. Because if you pregnant a woman without praying, ah, I don't know what will happen when the child will come without prayer. So, thank you so much. This is SNM TV. We were narrating this video of the wedding of Manasseh.